when I talk to students about the purpose of doing questions, uh, we've been taught and they give, they give feedback to me that they do questions in order to help with the learning process, in order to improve their learning, etc. But when we scratch at what they really believe the purpose of doing questions are, we find that most students' belief around why they should be doing questions um, come down to two main purposes or two main goals. One, I do questions to assess my knowledge. Two, I do questions to identify if I'm ready to pass. So when I say to students you need to be doing questions, part of the challenge that we have is their belief around why they would be doing that kind of gets in the way. And a large part of the challenge is that while students agree that questions are important, it's something that gets continually put off because if my belief is that I do questions when I am ready to assess my knowledge or when I need to know, you know, am I now ready to pass? If I know that I'm not ready to pass, it doesn't make sense to do questions. So the belief around why we do questions, um, I find is a big problem for students. And I find that as much as us as lecturers and as much as, you know, as I say to students, you need to do more questions, you need to do questions from earlier on in the year, to some extent, they, yeah, they, they agree, but their belief is still, that is correct, I need to do more questions. The unarticulated belief is when I'm ready to assess my knowledge. So while I'm saying you need to do questions before you're ready, they're going, yes, you're right, I need to do questions when I'm ready. And so the answer is to be ready faster. So I'll study faster, I'll study more, and hopefully you know, I'll reach that point of readiness earlier. So I find there's a, we're speaking on different, on different paths. In order to, to move past this, I want to expand your belief about why you're doing questions. We know what to say. So when a lecturer asks us or when people ask us, you know, why are you doing questions? We're like, oh, well, you know, it's part of the learning process and, you know, to the, but the reality is that, you know, every time I scratch it, it comes down to, uh, you know, assessing knowledge and am I ready to pass? So let's look at a couple more purposes and perhaps with a better, with a broader sense of purpose around questions, it will be easier for you to start doing questions earlier when you have a different objective. Because obviously, as you, if your objective is to identify, am I ready to pass, and you know that the answer is no, it doesn't make any sense to do practice questions until you get to that feeling of readiness.